Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Happy Thursday and happy football opening night day night. Thursday night football is going to happen. That's going to be very exciting. So let's watch that together. Let's break football together as we're doing that. Should be a lot of fun. Um, we're also going to kick off with this 2020 Panini Donruss football five box random team break number five with a chance to get uh, to win a box of Donruss sealed box. We'll send it to you sealed, which will be pretty cool. You can sell it. You can open it yourself. You can do whatever you want. You don't, there are no minimum spot requirements either. We'll just take all 32 names at the end, re-randomize them with a new dice roll, name on top gets it. If there's any points for whatever reason, we'll give that uh, to number two as one lot. No vet commons ship in this, as you know. A lot of exciting stuff in here, so thanks everybody right here for getting in. We appreciate that. Good crew here. All 32 teams are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Five and a six, 11 times for each list. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleventh and final time. I said eleven, right? Yeah, five and a six, eleven. After eleven, we got Oliver down to Will. After eleven. And then eleven times for the teams. One. Ten and eleventh and final time. After eleven, we got the Houston Texans. They're playing tonight. Down to the Colts. All right, there you go. So Oliver with the Texans. Ron, you got the Eagles. Uh, Jose with the Bills. Tyler with the Jets. David with the Giants. Jeremy with the Rams. Stephen with the Falcons. Ron with the Jags, Sefkia with the Browns, Zachary with the Lions, Ron with the Saints, Stephen Olsen with the Cardinals, Ron, Panthers, Vikings, Buccaneers, Michael Armstrong with the Ravens, the Purple Birds, Ron, you got the Steelers, Rexford with the Dolphins, Chris with the Packers, Maris, you got the Bengals, Ron with the Niners, Robert with the Titans, Kenny with the Chargers, Blake with my Raiders, nice, Jason K with the Seahawks, Chris, last spot mojo, Broncos, Ron, you also have the Washington football team. Seth Kia with the Cowboys, Jeremy with the Bears, Ron with the Chiefs, William with William Rosenthal with the Patriots, and another William with the Colts, Bulldog fan with some horses. All right, so there you go. Let's get all this on one page. Let's sort it by team. We're going to pause the video just for a second. Trades are allowed, so feel free to trade if you'd like, and when we come back, we'll see if there's any trades, and then the five box break. Stick around. All right, welcome back, folks. A little bit of trade chatter, but no deals were done. It's all good. Five box, Ram Team 5 on the 10th of September 2020, opening night for the NFL. Thanks, everyone, for joining us and joining all of our football breaks today on jazbeescasebreaks.com. My Tower's got a good question. Here you go, 2020. We're doing hobby boxes, right? I think this is the right one, yeah. 2020 Penny <laughs> Donners football. 2020 Panini Donners football. I, feel like I have no recollection of these breaks. Mike Tower was asking, what current player would be a Joe Burrow comp? That's a good question. What what current quarterback is most like Joe Burrow? It's a very good question. What do you think, everybody? I don't know if I have an answer for that. watch too much of his college stuff, but what did he look like in college? A Thin Ben? <laughs> Sean Jaspi saying Thin Ben. Not Big Ben, Thin Ben. What are the characteristics of Thin Ben? Big arm? Likes to throw down field? Maris can't really put his finger on it just yet. We'll have to just wait and see. Ron thinks maybe a more athletic Joe Montana. Wow. I 
think Bengals fans would love that. Does he run around a lot? Not not as rough and tumble, Sean Judge. I don't, I don't know if he could run around, I guess, as most modern quarterbacks tend to. And All right, here's box number one. Don't let me forget about giving away a box of this at the end. I, I'm, I have a feeling that I will. All right. Let's fly through these, boys and girls. Ooh, redemption already. There's Anthony Miller to 100. We'll set these aside. We'll sleeve and top load those um, a little bit later. Our shipping team will take care of that. Just in the interest of time, we want to breeze through these. There's Jerry Judy right here, rated rookie red. Not numbered, but it will ship. Deshaun Watson just got paid. Good, great press conference from him, too. He was very emotional about that, and he was very happy. All these inserts will ship, of course. There's Montez Sweat. To 90, you think he'll do more Old Spice commercials? You think Baker Mayfield bounces back? So I, I love the start of the football season. There's so many, so many questions that have been asked that I want to see answered over the course of a season. Should be a lot of fun. I know I said veteran commons don't ship, but if I find any, if I spy any Brady's, we'll make sure those. Uh, I'll make sure I try to pull some of those. He's in his new uniform, of course. I think that's going to be pretty exciting for people. Anyone? No, no guesses on that? Uh, it's Josh Allen right here for the Bills to 500. No guesses on that redemption? Justin Jefferson? So I have to, so have to get my head wrapped around all the rookies and where they all are now. Is this a, a one per case sort of situation? Not sure, but. die cut Logan Wilson to 25 for the Bengals. That'll be for Ameris. And that's a, that's a pretty thick Corey Davis relic right here. 71 out of 100. Two color patch for the Titans. Robert G with Tennessee. That's to 86. That's Chris Godwin. Chris Godwin with Tom Brady. That could be super interesting, too. I think Derwin James, our first poor Derwin James of the season. Who else is it? Anyone else out for the season? Poor Tyrell Williams. All right, the redemption is going to be Chase Young. Mr. Baseball, you got it. Nice. Bragging rights for you. Uh, that'll go to uh, Washington. Ron. There you go. Tell your friends, Mr. Baseball. Bragging rights. And a free top loader, Ron. Look at that. He's, he, he could have a huge season. Is is uh, is Chase Young our leading 
our leading uh, defensive rookie of the year candidate. Sean Jaffe says Kenneth Murray. Who's our Who's our leading offensive rookie of the year candidate? Sean Jaspi will say another Charger. Oh, Joe Burrow. Wow. When's the last time a receiver has won? Has has won a uh, Neil Brown's his rugs. When's the last time a receiver's won Rookie of the Year or Offensive Rookie of the Year? Usually QBs or RBs. Usually a back. It'd be cool. I mean, rugs would have to have a monster season, I would think. Sean also think maybe Anthony Gibson his hat has to be into the offensive rookie of the year ring. I don't know. With that speed, Ruggs I think can throw to himself, Sean Jaspi. We'll probably see that happen at some point in the season. Yeah, big, big, big show me season for Derek Carr, I would think, too. He's got a lot of weapons now. There's Keenan Allen for the Bolts. 29 out of 299. Chargers, that's going to be for Kenny. Uh, Odell Beckham Jr. was the last receiver to win Offensive Rookie of the Year. That, that will ship Elite Series, Tom Brady. I feel like I haven't seen any Burrow or Tua, just base cards. Yeah, there's Gardner Minshew. It's Justin Herbert. There's Justin Jefferson to 100. Lamar Jackson, red. Isaiah Simmons, canvas. DJ Shark. Devo Samuel, die cut to 75 for the Niners. That'll be for Ron. Pat Patrick Mahomes, we'll see him in action tonight. Chiefs, that's for Ron. There he is, Odell Beckham Jr. How do the Browns do this season? I feel like Kitchens really, really made them regress last season, but... New faces in the coaching staff. Does that unlock the potential for the Cleveland Browns? They were kind of a, weren't they kind of a sexy uh, Super Bowl appearance? Super Bowl winner pick? I feel like some people were talking about that. Austin Hooper to 100. There's Ruggs. And there's Antonio Gibson to uh, 299 for the Washington football team. Ron Wester, yeah, he's one of the favorites, right? They got rid of Adrian Peterson because of his, because of him, and his improvements in camp. We'll see. Could be a favorite for the uh, offensive rookie of the year. 
It's Heath Miller. Power formula. That looks kind of cool. That looks pretty cool. Tom Brady. To 100, Cole Beasley. I saw something earlier today. Um, I think on either on ESPN or NFL Network. I forget who. It was. Jersey sales. Number one jersey sale. Did everyone see this earlier today? What's the number one selling jersey so far, thus far, this season? Should be pretty obvious. It was number two that surprised me, according to this report. Yep, Tom Brady, Amaris is right. Tom Brady is the number one selling jersey. What's the number two selling jersey? It's another quarterback. So Tom Brady Buccaneers, obviously. New Jersey there. The second highest selling jersey as of now, according to this report I saw. Mr. Baseball actually got it. Cam Newton. Maybe it was, a, was it an Adam Schefter report? An Ian Rappaport report? It's one of those guys. That's what he said. That's what that reporter said, Neo. Could be different now, but as of that reporting, number one selling jersey. I think I feel like it's according to one other one retailer, Fanatics, maybe either Fanatics or Dick Sporting Goods or something like that. Whoever does this, but yeah, number one selling jersey thus far. Very you know, just before week one, Tom Brady jerseys as a Buccaneer, and the second one, Cam Newton as a Patriot. Someone fact check that. I was surprised. I was like, huh, Cam Newton. According to a Fox News article, Josh says, then it's Kittle, then Mahomes. See? Crazy, right? Cam Newton. I mean, we'll see how that changes throughout the season, but I thought that was really surprising. All right. Let's keep rolling through the next box. It's Michael Gallup to 100. R.I.P. Pat Tillman. And passing the torch, Donald Driver. To Devontae Adams, passing the torch. Nice dual relic there to 25 for Green Bay. Chris Maxwell got randomized. The Packers. I like the little kind of flame emoji that they're using there, but they turned it into a, a window, a relic window. I like that. It looks pretty sharp. Who does everyone have in tonight's game? Just to just to be a contrarian, I kind of thought maybe you know maybe maybe, maybe uh, Houston surprises the Chiefs. I actually don't think it's going to happen. Did not invest a lot in that, but I don't know. Every, everyone's assuming it's going to be Kansas City, right? But is that is that a is that two square? Is the sharp side investing in Houston? There's Shaquille Griffin, 40 out of 50. Seahawks, that's going to be 
Um, Jason K with Seattle. There's a die cut right here. Zach Ertz. Is Zach Ertz not happy with his contract situation? What's going on there? Eagles, Ron Wester. It's Patriots, Tom Brady. Poor Tyrell Williams out for the season, but maybe more opportunities for Darren Waller now. Ooh, that I don't know. Is Brandon Cooks playing tonight? There's Chase Claypool to 500. There's Clyde Edwards-Hilaire. See you, Kevin. I don't think these are too common, right? This could be uh, this could be one of the one of the favorites, a favorite leading candidate for rookie of the year, Clyde Edwards Hilaire, Ron Wester with the Chiefs. I kind of like those optic cards in this set. Yeah, an optic preview. Oh, they're gonna talk about Brandon Cooks right now. Oh, I would love it if Brandon Cooks changed his number to 99. That would be awesome, Mike Tower. Poor Von Miller. Is he out for the season? Cooks is expected to play tonight. I guess he's battling through a quad thing, but it looks like he has improved over the last 24 hours. Likely out for the season, Vaughn. They, they were reading my mind. Vaughn Miller will undergo surgery on ankle. Likely out for the season. T.Y. Hilton to 500. Herbert for uh, the Bolts. That's going to go to Kenny. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Over the ankle bone. I like the sound of that, even if he is a dirty Bronco. Fourth box out of five. Almost there, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for hanging with us. I think we got a lot of orders to go through after this. I know some stuff is sold out already. We still have a few mini breaks to go for a certain break, so keep it going. have to do let's refresh the website here we just have four spots left straight up plus two more Donruss hanger boxes to knock out the 28 box football mixer now the the interesting thing with the football mixer if you have not paid attention too closely read that item description check out the bounties that were given away in that football mixer it's 28 boxes Right? If you hit a card that is 25 out of 50, exactly 25 out of 50, we're going to give you 250 bucks of rate credit. You're like, Joe, so let, are you telling me I can get the worst team randomized to me in the 28 box football mixer, but as long as I hit any card numbered exactly 25 out of 50, you're going to give me 250 bucks of rate credit? 
The answer is yes. Joe, what if I get two cards? Are you still going to give me two $250 break credit? You won't. I will. We will, ladies and gentlemen. No max winners. We could lose our shirts in this break. We might. It has happened before. And there's like three other bounties there too. Check it out. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. You can find different ways to, to win money. So again, even if you don't get the quote unquote best team, right? You can still win a lot of money off of us. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Right, tune in later for shirtless Jaspies. It's like, what hell? We'll come in the next day. What happened? More passing the torch, but this time it's out of 115 for the Packers. And what happened? Well, gave away too many bounties in that mixer last night. We lost our shirts. got to 70 Ryan Tannehill Titans that'll be for Robert G it's Joe Mixon we have not seen a Joe Burrow in these nor in these regular base Donners cards it feels it feels odd Buzz, what's going on? How are you? So I'm kind of going a little slowly through this rake. People seem to really like the LaVisca Chenault Jr. to 99. So Gardner Minshew actually has little, some weapons here and there. That goes to Ron Wester and the Jaguars. We got DeAndre Swift to 100. T. Higgins, where are you going? See that? T. Higgins wanted to go with the, the filler card in there. All right. Ooh, yeah, Buzz, uh, you're, you're up in that Northern California area. I hope that uh, it doesn't get too scary close to you, but you're saying the smoke is getting thick. Hard to breathe. Hang in there. I have. I have. It looks like 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 a Terminator movie or something like that. No. Uh huh. Was well, just just trying to like outrun flames or what? What's happening? Man, that's scary up there. No filter, no nothing. <laughs> like the part of a scary movie. Yeah, it's de definitely like the apocalypse. There's Jared Allen. Four out of ten. Man, I know. Look at that UPS. Is just Man, always working. Yeah, thankfully here at Jaspies, we're, we're, we're luckily far from it, but it's just all, it's all around us. Kind of an overcast day today, but on a clear day, you can see all the smoke in the distance. There's one just north of Pasadena, which is not that far from us, but in the mountains up there. Some out in the Riverside area. So, hang in there. There's a nice Tom Brady right here. So, hang in there. I'm glad that the... I felt bad for the firefighters during the heat wave, man. But I think it's been a lot cooler this week, so hopefully, hopefully that helps.
All right, fifth and final box here in random team number five. Thanks, everyone, for getting into the action. Really appreciate it. We got, we got plenty of football on this opening night, ladies and gentlemen. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. The, the crew here is fired up. Teddy was super excited. Got me fired up even more. I woke up to NFL Network. I, man. And we're going to see two good quarterbacks on a Thursday night, too. Deshaun Watson, Patrick Mahomes. Hopefully we see a lot of points. It'll be good. Uh, it's just the smoke that's real bad. All right, well, hang in there, Buzz. What's that? What, just with, like, everything happening? <laughs> that's just, wow. That's going to be crazy. Look at the, I know I got we got I got NFL and Lakers to watch me like I need like four different screens tonight. I know we're gonna have to break at the card bar. There's four TVs above the card bar here at the shop, and we're gonna have it tuned to all sorts of different games. Oh yeah, there's like a HD sports mix or something like that, right? I might need that actually. All right, Ryan H., what's going on? Welcome. <laughs> Obviously not a charge. Mike Tower, you may need to adjust the colors on your, on your monitor, on your television. Make sure those red, blues, and greens, red, yellow, whatever, the test patterns all line up properly. Chase Claypool, 22 out of 99. Steelers, Ron Wester. All right, John McCall, what's going on? Being from San Diego, always been a Charger fan. Now you're a Colt fan. On, a, on the account of Mr. Rivers? Got him on a fancy team. I'm rooting for him. He's actually got an offensive line. It's going to protect him a little bit better. That might that might be just enough difference for, for him to have a – not be throwing a little wildly. I feel like we need to find at least one rated rookie Joe Burrow card, right? Or a Tua? I don't think I've seen a Joe Burrow insert, to be honest with you. I think there's been some Tua inserts, but I want one, one of these rated rookie cards to pop here. I've seen a couple of Justin Herberts. Yeah, I got the Tua. I got a couple Herberts. There's Gabriel Davis. I feel like I need a... Uh, I need to find that Joe Burrow. Nice, Mike Tower. <laughs> it is not the Tua. Big Ben back. To make make a make a big change for the Steelers. I cut Cortland Sutton to 75. Antonio Gandy Golden, red. Those are not numbered, but obviously it's a rookie. It'll ship. Odell Beckham Jr. We got Joe Montana, four out of ten, press proof Chiefs edition, on that one. Nice low number on that one for Ron Wester. Uh oh, what happened? Your Marcus Mariota dream is over before it ever started. I did not notice any. Oh, he's he's he got IR'd. Oh. 
Well, though, who's the Raiders' backup quarterback now? 130 out of 299, Troy Aikman relic. Uh, Safkia with the Cowboys. And I was kind of hoping for... Uh, I was kind of hoping for, for him to do some trick plays here and there this season. Where are the trick play guys? Lynn Bowden Jr. traded. Apparently Lynn Bowden Jr., there, 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 was, there were some off-the-field issues. And that's why the Raiders kind of dumped him kind of quickly like that. But. There's a Tua rated rookie. An undisclosed injury for Mariota. Time for Josh Rosen. Has Josh Rosen been picked up? Oh, just three weeks? But if they IR'd him, isn't that like a mandatory, like... Oh, IR is different this year. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Cause, yeah, because before IR was like pretty much done for like half the season. All right, all right. Okay. So, Kip, your, your, uh, your Mariota dream may not be over just yet. All right, well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That was five boxes of Donruss football. So here's a quick little recap right there. Some out of tens, some Brady, some Tua, some nice low. I, I like this uh, optic preview right here. Clyde Edwards Hilaire, I think, is nice. We're going to see him in action. Maybe start off his, his Rookie of the Year campaign. We've got the nice Chase Young redemption for Washington. And we got Corey Davis starting things off. I like how thick the relics are here, too. So there you go, boys and girls. Uh, let's give away the... I almost forgot. Let's give away... I was like, in my head, I was like... You gotta do something else, Joe. I gotta give away a box, ladies and gentlemen. Everyone has a shot at it. No minimum on teams or anything like that. So Steven Olson down to Ron Wester. Let's copy all of your names. All right? Everyone has a shot, right? That's what it says. Yeah, all 32 names. There you go. So everybody has a shot at the box. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Name on top after five. Two and a three. We'll get a sealed box. We'll ship it to you sealed. It'll probably be separate from all of the cards that you get, so don't panic if you don't if you got your cards and you don't get the box yet. Two and a three, five times will be following shortly. Name on top after five. One, two, three, four, and fifth and final time after five. Congrats to big thanks to everybody right here from two down to thirty two for getting into the action. And congrats to William Rosenthal. William, I don't think I called your name. At all during this break. Who did you have? You had the Patriots. There are a couple Brady Patriots inserts, but I think that was basically it. So, congrats to you. You're getting a sealed box in the mail. So, uh, if you choose to open it, let us know if you get anything cool. If not, you can sell it if you want. You do whatever you want. Thanks, William. Have a good one. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. I'm Joel. See you next time. Bye.